then she can't. If you don't, I just think that you should give me an explanation as to, like, you really listening to stalkers and psychos and complete narcs and weirdos just because they went in a comic section? How does that make sense? So because the people talking about themselves went in your comment section, are you saying you actually believe that? Anything they have to say about me? I don't know any of them. They've never met me. How could they speak on someone they don't know anything about? They make videos sounding insane, just making up lies about me that are true about them. Like, I don't need to, like, I don't give a fuck about people like that, like, just being honest. Like, none of those people have a future without me, just being realistic. Like, there's no future for you if you don't fucking get on board and fuck with this label, especially when it comes to music. This is what y'all don't get. Like, even when we did, like, acting shit, people would try to sideline me, but at the same time, we're trying to copy everything I do, remember? And people was trying to build their rap shit off of me because they found out I rap and they bitches liked it. All you bitches are haters and you're fucking blind, deaf, dumb, stupid, poor in the hell and killer. And you know I'm a legend and that I represent something very real. And so you'd rather hate. Like, I understand power. It's just like with Tupac. Like, I learned from Tupac how to have political power. I didn't learn it all from him, but I used him as an influence. I carried off where he left off. So everyone's amazed because they didn't think that I would do what nobody's ever done, but I'm doing it. Like, I told y'all, I'm going to be the man that shuts down the entire industry. I'm the opposing spirit. You have the devil spirit, literally Satan himself, and Beyonce. I'm the opposite spirit, the antithesis to evil. And that's what possessed me, and it's inside me. So that's not something I chose. That's something he chose. Whoever he is, our creator, love. So they're using me. Just like these people are being used by demonic spirits, they're using me and my and my, my body as a vessel. And I think this is where a lot of this singing and voice shit is coming from. I'm learning it on my own. I'm teaching it to myself, but I think a lot of it's coming from spiritual shit, like everything. I don't think it's all me. So and I can't say that it is me, but you know what I'm saying? I just I think that I think that somehow it was supposed to happen. And I think I attracted it. And I, I just know that I got chosen to do what I do. And it's a spiritual war. But I'm the man who can act as combating Illuminati and his music. I'm fighting. That's what my music is about. All of it. Everything Michael Jackson did, Tupac did. I'm doing the same thing, but I'm not. I didn't sell my soul like them, and I'm not part of their system or industry. I'm independent. So it puts us in a different boat in different circumstances because they can't really do me the way they did those people. You need to fucking matter. So, like I say, I mean, they can't do me the way they did all of them. They just can't. So, I mean, it all just depends on what the fuck people want to do. And, you know, that's about it, man. But like I said, all this disrespectful shit and people being disrespectful, I mean, that shit is weak. It's like people who are strong, they come with respect. Respect is the only way you build anything. That's why I got death before dishonor tattooed on my chest. I don't tolerate disrespect. Now I'm not going to throw away my shit every day for losers either, which is y'all again. It wasn't enough that all y'all are disrespectful and can't build anything off respect. But you act like I'm a blown away and I work my ass off my entire life and all I've done is fight the system and stand up with people. Like, there's stories of me, if you listen, like, there's stories of me in, in Dallas, in the mall, in the most expensive mall where, like, security took me outside and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, they didn't take me. Like, I was trying to make security. And I was selling my CDs in the most expensive mall with a fucking do-rag. Like, I do my shit for real what I do. Like, I've actually stood up for this talk. I really earn my respect. These people on YouTube saying, I earn my respect. Like, I'm about to wait, man. The fuck? You can't earn your respect. I'm using your ears in the street. All y'all do is talk about me in the street. You're not shut up. Yeah. Oh, is it 125th in Lexington? Cool. I'll be there. I'll show up one day. I swear to God, I'll have a you. You know what I mean? All these people talking about, pull up. You won't do this. I'm, I'm trying to figure out where y'all at. Oh, yeah. And I'm gonna pull up in my own time and try to see you out there. And I'm not like y'all, not gonna pretend, but I'm Period, because I want to see you got to prove it to me, brother. Because I'm telling you right now, no, none of you can see me in one-on-one fight. You can't see me on the back, brother. Period, you talk too fucking much. Shut up. Like, no, we're fighting LA is stupid. Because both of them are fucking broken down bums and can't fight. Sal's talk all this shit. And what we did with Cliff, maybe you shit to Cliff, bro. Stop it. Boy, if you had hit Cliff's ass or you had really hit him or anything, you would have non-stop talking. He was on the camera crying. Like, you didn't? You did yourself in. If you had really fucked Cliff up, you kept saying, I missed. How do you miss against Cliff and Rain? It's like fighting a fucking cat. Like, literally, the cat's like, ow, and slapping shit. You do a karate kick, and you're telling me you're so slow and out of shape that you couldn't hit Clifton Rainey to get moving. Well, that's what you do in a fight. He kind of knew what he was doing with you and squared up, and you got scared, and he threw a kick, a thunder kick, thunder kick, thunder punch, you know? So, I just I just don't get y'all, man, because you're really annoying. You give people a headache. I mean, you can't talk in reality. Like, no, we're to represent himself, and we're being a bitch, you be a man, and just come get this fucking verbal ass with him. You don't know you want to box LA? Ah, oh, I'm box you, you won't give me a gym. You refuse. Everybody sees this. So, it's, it's just been confusing to me because. I mean, who would it not be with these people? A bunch of people that get online all day and talk about shit that doesn't exist. Like, fuck all that. It's pretty weird, don't you think? I, like, I can't believe you people. Like, everything with y'all is trolling and trying to create frustration in other people. But then y'all mad. Like, it's the same with Nutty. Like, he's super mad at Elton. Like, bro, why do you care? You sit there and say, I don't care what you say, but you make every video at LA. Like, when I tell these people, I don't care what you say, I don't make every video for them. I make none for them. They just force themselves into my show, and then I'm like, fuck it. Here you go, and give you your light and make you look stupid. Then they keep making videos as if they didn't see the video. Like, my videos shut all y'all down. Any of them I release shut y'all down. It's over after that. There is no continuum, you know? This is not Mario Party, you know what I mean? You don't get a continuation. You die, you die. If he dies, he dies. You know? So, I don't know, man. I mean, if, if Nutty's gonna keep bullshit, and he's gonna keep doing what the fuck he do, and he's just gonna sit there and be a bitch, I can't do nothing for him. I can't do nothing for any of y'all until you stop being a hoe. Because I'm here with a tangible record label. I've got tangible music. I've got tangible big veins in my hand and in my mother's fucking arm. You know, that you'll never have, and bitches love the veins on my cock. That's right, and they love to lick them. And you motherfuckers won't even pay on I have a tangible record label. I've got tangible albums out, released digitally to all retailers. Do you have that? No. Nutty, you are not a rapper. You don't have any fucking music out. Selling them to your YouTube audience is nothing, and you play people out of their money, you fucked everyone over, and you think it's so bitch make they don't open their mouth. This is why I can't fuck with y'all people. Y'all is what created the Dr. Omar Johnson of this world. The Tommy Soda Fags. Like, 
Bro, that's y'all's thing, bro. Y'all ride dick. Y'all ride them niggas in these bags. I, I don't do that. That's y'all's fucking thing. I don't sit there and ride dick. I do what I need to do and I do it for me.